We are in LA. It is, what day is it? It's December 5th. So it is Tuesday, December 5th. It's 7.30 in the morning because Toronto is like actually 10.30 in the morning. We actually got to LA yesterday. We hit the flight, made it here, um, grabbed a, like a really quick bite to eat. Okay, so I tried vlogging last night. I've been spending all the time. Couple women by my side. I got sinning on my mind. What's been on red wine? I've been sitting there for ages, ripping out the pages. How to get so faded? How to get so faded? Oh, no, no, don't me. That's it. Yeah, it looks like we are in a dorm. What's this? Okay. I think so. This is so, you know what this is? This is very like indie. Wanted to get free my mind. It gives it character. This is how it ends. I feel the chemicals burn in my bloodstream. Don't be alarmed. I did bring some tears. Fading right out. Oh, we're in LA. We need music. Yeah, we do. I turned it off. We are officially in LA. I told you guys in my last video. Yeah. You did it. I watched it. I swear to God, I put it in. I was like, you wrote it, but you. I didn't. wrote it. Okay, you, I didn't verbally wrote, say she it. She wrote it, but she didn't say anything. I was catching it because I was like, that's what's me. I got the <laughs> notification bell. Oh, thanks. <laughs> now we're gonna head to Beverly Hills. We're gonna go grab some sushi. I think we're gonna go out for a drink or two. This is Kat's first time in LA. Yay! <laughs> so, the whole reason why we're here is to go to Refinery29. They're opening like this event. So we're going there on Wednesday night. But until then, we just get to like pretty much do do whatever we want. We're gonna go grab sushi. We're gonna go grab drinks. We got like Imagine. high key, almost like, not even high key. We got interrogated pretty we hard at the border. We held up the line enough. Sorry, yeah, maybe. they were like, they were convinced that we were coming for unauthorized reasons. And Kat was like, the guy was like, have you ever been arrested? I was like, no. And he looks at Kat and he goes, have you? She goes, in the US? <laughs> and I look at her and I'm like, have you ever been arrested? Who are you? I'm surprised he didn't say like, are you sure? Yeah, when I was like, no, he's like, are you sure? And he had me questioning if I had ever been arrested you and just not like known it. You're like, I shouldn't have cheated on that test in grade seven. They know, they know I did it. I literally thought he wasn't gonna let us through, but we're here, we made it. All right, let's rally, let's do this. We were like, yeah, like, let's get ready, let's go out. We got ready for so long. Let's go for sushi and sugar fish. And Pat is like allergic to the world. And I'm vegan, so we go to the sugarfish place and we're like, can we get cucumber rolls and yam tempura? And they're I can't like, have avocado. Avocado, sesame seeds, shellfish, all that legume, so I can't have like um, hummus. Can we get a cucumber roll, one without sesame seeds, and then yam tempura? And they're like, we don't make those, we just make cucumbers. So we were like, we got we grabbed cucumber rolls and they were really good. We ended up going to Target because we were freezing. It was actually so cold last night, and we bought sweatpants and baggy shirts. We got Stranger Things shirts. Oh, my and then the sweatpants I got, guys, are friggin' Hogwarts. Let me just. This is nice. It's really cute. So our first night in LA, we literally went to Target. And our room is haunted. But it's basically a really, really old hotel room that they redid in 2014. But Kat, like the minute but we they, walked in, Kat was like, this it, is haunted. They kept it in like. Box. They kept the character of it. And so <laughs> there's these windows. And last night, Kat's like, oh my God, there's a handprint. I was like, actually, there's two handprints and they're it's kids' like, handprints. Oh, oh, okay, bring it back. <laughs> Look at those handprints. Not creepy at all. Not creepy at all. We had talked about in my sister's room when I was a child having little kid handprints on the walls. The would sum up of the trip so far is we Didn't attempted we? to get food. We went to Target and our place is haunted. <laughs> yeah, the highlight is definitely the sweatpants. Hogwarts sweatpants, you can't go wrong. I think this morning we're gonna head to Beverly Hills and maybe go shopping, grab some breakfast, come back, get ready, and then go to Santa Monica. So that's kind of the plan. I just grabbed a misto. If you guys are curious, I've been getting the like a grande misto with the Christmas blend and coconut milk. And then I've been adding the chestnut praline syrup because it's so freaking good. Let's get to it, I guess. You know what it kind of tastes like, actually? It kind of tastes like peanut butter. Can I smell it? 
shopping we went to the Grove and then we just hit Urban Outfitters to which I spent more money than I probably should have but this sweater is a great find we're gonna try and get ready as fast as possible and then basically head to Santa Monica also we want to take another attempt at sushi <laughs> that's currently the plan it's also way too hot in here for this sweater so I'm gonna strip this off and get ready <laughs> some food there's not much we can do today unfortunately we're during all of these fires around LA basically we're trying to stay off the roads today so we might not be able to do as much exploring of LA as we thought which is totally fine because obviously like we care more about people's homes. yeah these are people's homes and stuff so we just want to stay off the roads to keep them clear we're in like the downtown LA area so I think we're gonna stay around here for the day well actually we didn't just wake up but we've just been chilling <laughs> all morning in our hotel and we're freaking hungry do some shopping hang out on the patio and then we have the event tonight Vlogged like nothing this morning because we literally we just laid in bed and watched news, watched the news, fell back asleep, walked to Starbucks. <laughs> just hoping that everybody who's affected by these fires, like all the people, all the animals, all their houses, like are okay. We're just gonna do our best to explore as much of downtown LA as we can, considering it's our last day here. extra hot me still for my throat. We're about to hit the airport. The caption, like the, the, the overall synopsis of this trip is we, we tried. It's a fun little getaway to LA. You got to see Santa Monica. Yeah. We got to like explore a little bit, but take me home.
miles seems far to a man who hasn't fallen quite as hard. I am finally home. Can I just start by saying how good it feels to be back in Toronto? The event last night that we went to was the 29 Rooms held by Refinery29 and that was so cool. Like all of this, the clips you guys saw were amazing but what you didn't see, we were chilling like side by side with Cody Simpson and playing it so cool. But like when I say playing it cool, we were like to each other not playing it cool, but in general we were like, this is normal. Now that I'm home, I'm actually going to unpack. I'm going to get a few work things done. I just ordered Uber Eats because I have no groceries, solely because I'm also leaving tomorrow to go to Kingston, so I knew I wouldn't be here all week, and I knew I wouldn't be here all weekend. So with no food, I justified ordering myself a big, massive falafel pita. And I'm gonna do all my laundry, clean up, unpack. I wanna wash my new friend's sweater that you guys saw that I got from Urban Outfitters. I wanna wash that and wear it tomorrow um, on the road. So I have a lot of laundry to do. I have some coast stuff and some YouTube stuff to catch up on. But all that matters is I'm home and I'm back in my routine. It feels so good. Don't get me wrong, I'm beyond grateful to travel. It is so amazing. But something about being home around the holidays, like just with Christmas coming up, I just love being here. So it's not home yet without Bentley here, but you guys get the drill. Aside from that, I hope that this vlog was fun and entertaining. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you guys to the moon back and I'll see you guys all next week. Bye guys. Oh my God, it feels so good to be home.